Hello. Hello, teacher. Hi, how are you doing today? Hello, teacher. Hi. Good night. Thank you. Good. Everything good? Good evening. Yes. And you? I'm okay. I'm doing all right. Thank you. Okay. I'm happy to see you again. Did you have a good day? Thank you. Did you have a good day today? My day was so busy. <laughs> Everyone yes, seems to be busy. Mm. But are you busier than before the, the lockdown and the quarantine? Or is it the same? How do you feel? Some days it is. It is, it is more busy. It's busier some, some days. You can say more busy too. Okay. All right. Well, let's get started. This is where we left off last night. We were talking about jobs, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, Glenda, would you read the objective, please? Yeah. By the end of this class, you will develop skills in listening to descriptions. Uh -huh. You will develop skills. Develop skills uh, in listening to descriptions. Very good. Thank you. Okay, let's listen to this. Everyone, Raul. Okay. Hi everyone. With the end of this class, you will develop skills in listening to descriptions. After listening to the audio program, you'll complete a quiz in order to check your understanding. So let's get started. You'll listen to three people describe their jobs. Your task is to answer the following questions. Do they like their jobs? Why or why not? Okay, make sure you answer those questions at the end, okay? Do they like their jobs? Why not? Task is to answer the following questions. Do they like their jobs? Why or why not? So, where are you working this summer, Carlos? Oh, I'm working as a tutor in a learning center for kids. Interesting. What kinds of things do the kids do there? Well, they work on subjects they need help in. Uh, mainly math and English. Is your job hard? No, not at all. The kids work on computers most of the time. We have to help them get started and be there when they run into problems. Do you enjoy it? Oh, yes. Working with kids is so much more fun than working with adults. And I get to choose my own hours. As long as I work eight hours a day, I can come in at any time from 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. Lucky you! Paul, did you find a summer job yet? Yeah, I'm working in a restaurant. Oh, how's it going? Oh, the money's not bad. What are you doing? Are you waiting tables? I wish. No. I'm working in the kitchen. I cut up stuff for the chef. Vegetables and meat and things. I also wash the dishes. Oh, yuck. Yeah, it's pretty hard work. I didn't realize how hot it is in a restaurant kitchen until I took this job. So why don't you quit? I'd love to, but I need the money. So what kind of job did you find for the summer? I'm working for a marketing company. I'm doing telephone marketing. Oh, so you're one of those people who drives me crazy by calling me up and trying to persuade me to buy something that I have absolutely no need for. Exactly. Do you like it? Believe it or not, I do. It's mostly a bunch of students working there, and we have a lot of fun when we're not making calls. It's really easy, too, since we just have to read from a script. Are you doing this full-time? Yeah. But I work from 2 in the afternoon until 11 at night, so I get to sleep as late as I want to in the morning. Okay, I hope you got some details and so we can answer some of the questions now. Let's see. Um, let's check the questions. Hold on. Oh, they're back here. 
let's do number one. If you have it, everyone should be on section 2.9. Okay, let's answer those questions. So we have number one, Wilbur, can you read it, please? Remember, you're on mute. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Uh, what kind of job does Carlos do? Um, Carlos, he is tutor for kids. Okay. Uh, this was the first speaker, right? I don't yep. remember his name. Number okay. two, it is. What kind of job does Julia do? What? What kind of job does Julia do? Julia marketing agent. Very good. Okay. Let's see Gabriel, number three. Mm, what kind of job does Paul do? I think he's a uh, the chef assistant. Okay. For Inmar. <clears throat> what kind of job does Paul do? <clears throat> Hold on, I think this is repeated. It's the same it's question, the same. isn't it? It's the same. <laughs> yeah, it's the same one. Four. Teacher, and then the, the answer of the number two? So Carlos, Julia, telemarketing, uh, yeah. and so four. It says, "Who doesn't like what they do and why?" Who? Uh -huh. Carlos. Mm -hmm. Carlos doesn't like his job because he doesn't. Uh, no, 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 it's not all. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, doesn't oh. like his job. Oh, the first oh. Oh, that's the first one. <laughs> and it's really hot in the kitchen. Okay, let's see if this works. Okay, yes, it did. Very good, good job. So before we continue, because we're about to start section three, so we're making a lot of progress, I would like us to finish discussing some questions related to work uh, for us to practice some vocabulary and fluency, okay? So I sent some questions last night, but I will send the rest of them. If you didn't discuss these, because I know you, you only discussed the first three, but not, for example, how long do you want to work? Is it better to be a boss or, or, or an employee and so on? Okay, I will send those questions right now. And let's discuss in small groups of three, okay? Do you have any questions about that? No. No? Okay. So accept the invitation. I will send you the questions through WhatsApp and let's get speaking, okay? Here we go. Uh, like talk about your jobs you have right now or maybe right now, the job you want to you would like to have I sent the questions through whatsapp do you have them yes I have them okay let's start discussing those okay yes yes it's correct 
Where is the <laughs> questions? Yeah. What are some what of are the worst the... jobs you can think of? Mm. I don't know. I think that um, there isn't a bad job. <laughs> Maybe if you like and you enjoy what you do, it's a good job. If you can earn money and help your family, it's, it's a good job. I don't know a uh, worse job. Um, maybe the people who clean bathrooms, uh, some worse. Um, Uh, I don't. I, I think not is work, but it's dangerous. Is when people work in the in the trash car or trash. Uh, yeah, trash it's car. Truck. It's a truck. Trash. The trash truck. The trash. Uh -huh. ah. The trash truck. Yeah, trash. it's dangerous. Uh -huh. okay, I think I don't think it's not worse, but I don't think it's bad. But I think it's dangerous. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. In Spanish we say not is dangerous, but in English say it's not dangerous. Okay. It's, it's not bad. It's not, uh -huh. it's it's not, not bad. bad. Uh -huh. Okay. Not bad. Yeah, Thank you. Not I agree. That's dangerous. Mm -hmm. For your health. Yeah. Your health. Uh -huh. yeah. Exactly. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, for example, uh, um, uh, forensic, or I don't like uh, jobs like like doctors either. Uh, because you have to to work with um, uh, with people that is um, that are that are that are um, injured that are injured yeah that are injured uh, and I don't like the blood uh, that's I think that is the worst uh, kind Word. of job yeah. for me yes okay. What do you think, guys? Or did you already answer? No, eh? we can't see you. Can you hear us? Uh, the lights run out. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> I, so bad. Totally dark. Lights went off. It's raining really hard. Really? Yep. At least yes, my place. It's raining oh very hard. Here too. Oh, wow. It's raining hard. Good thing is we don't hear that. I have some students and you can't help hearing the rain and pa pa pa. sounds so <laughs> noisy. <laughs> Here it's not raining yet, but the, it's almost it's, it's about almost to, raining. It's about to rain. About and about I haven't to. lost my connection because I using my data from your from phone's data. Phone. Data, yes. Mm -hmm. I, oh, let's see I how long it lasts. Wi-Fi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see how long it lasts. Well, thank you for making the effort, Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> Money, and that is the 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 best. Um, the well, the the, the, the best of what what we we can do, and and of course I agree with with. With the second opinion, and that there are words that are that need more strength than other, uh, or are harder. For example, in my case, I've been working in an office, and, and I and when I work uh, in my home, or in my home has uh, in a construction, for example. Oh, I, I can I can spend one day uh, working with the sand, with concrete. Um, uh, mm, I don't. What question are you discussing, guys? Uh, about the first question, what are some of the worst jobs you can think of? Okay, and did everybody answer that question? Uh, only... Yes. Yeah, Karen. Okay, Karen, we can't see you. I am having troubles with the internet connection because there is a big thunderstorm in my area. 
Yeah, everybody's telling the same thing that it's raining. Hard. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. terrible. So okay. I, I've been I've been out and in in this class. <laughs> in and out, like the restaurant, okay. <laughs> <laughs> in and out, okay. Well, but we can hear you clearly right now. So let's discuss another question. Let's try to be brief with the answers, okay? Not so long so that everyone can participate, but still try but, to. But for me, that was that was a job is being a a forensic. Uh huh. Yeah. For me, it's personally right because some people like that. Whoever does it, it's because they like it. It's a little bit scary. Yeah. It's somewhat scary. Okay, next okay. question. Next question. Yes, it and they got looted. Looted. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, who's next? Hey, we don't know what happened with Marcela. Marcella. She gets disconnect. Um, I okay. can't hear very well because it's raining <laughs> right now, but yeah, it is raining. The, the question is how long do you want to work? Yes. Uh, in my case, in this question, I do want... you mean how long about hours or how long about years in my life? <laughs> years in your life. Ah, okay. Yep. How long in my do you case, want to work? I want I want to work I think I, I think I can. Not, not since, but until. Until? Uh, until I can, until I'm able to. Until. Yep. I'll until. see if I can send someone here to practice with you, okay? Maybe I will bring Karen. Okay, yeah. thank you. So there's some groups of four and you're only two, so you can practice. Okay. Yeah, we were with Marcela, but she lost connection. Yeah, okay. Ah, here is Marcela again. Hold on. I'm going to bring her. It's back. raining really hard, teacher. We can hear you well. But yeah. uh, do you have earphones, Cindy, so you can hear us better? I can. I can uh, get. I couldn't get the headphones. Okay. Ah, okay. So, yeah, get closer. But we can hear you well. Yeah. Marcela <laughs> is joining you. So, she's, she's back. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yes. Hey. <laughs> oh, <example>. oh, true. <laughs> Other girl, okay. for example, is uh, the Lysman. Lysman. Is the what, JC? What? Excuse me? What did you say? Lysmans. With the people to clean up the tower. To, ah. to, oh. to get maintenance for the maintenance for light transmission. But it's dangerous, really dangerous. Uh, it's very that. dangerous. Uh huh. They could get electrocuted. I wore yeah. or fall many, many, <laughs> many years ago. Did you work exciting. that? Excuse me. How long do you want to work? I want to work until I die. <laughs> what about you guys? Yeah, I, I, I hope so too. Yes, right. You guys? But, but according to law, in, the, in El Salvador, women are supposed to work until 55 years old and men until 60. No, I think it's been updated uh, until the age of, is that right guys? Or is it women until the age of 60 and men until the age of 65? Or is it 55, 60? Yeah, I guess it's in this, in this, in this A. 60, 65, right? I think they modified it, Karen, I'm not sure. No? Mm -hmm. No. Yeah, but imagine if you are too old, if you are working, sometimes it depends how is your life or how you have been in your life. Uh -huh. Is if you are energetic or how you feel? Yeah, it depends on. Every time you say depend, use on, okay? Or depending okay. on. Okay. It's 
Então. Ah, mesmo isso aí. You didn't say anything, did you? Sorry? You didn't answer this question, did you? Ah, how long do you want? I would like to work for a long time. I work uh, in a factory. And, and there are uh, the manufacturing, manufacturing coordinators that have to work on chief. So they have to work uh, at, at, at night, over, uh, overnight. Uh, well, in the sheet of night. Uh, so I always uh, uh, told to them that they, they choose the, their, their profession so they don't have to complain. <coughs> they shouldn't complain. Yeah. They shouldn't complain. They shouldn't complain, complain actually. Mm -hmm. it say it's a night shift and I night. always tell them. When you use tell, you don't need to. Tell to someone now, right? But tell someone. Mm -hmm. So what profession are you talking about, Leila? Uh, manuf uh, people who work in manufacturing. Uh, people who work. Remember, people is plural in manufacturing. Oh, sure. but, uh, okay. I don't think they choose that. I think they have to do it. That's why they complain. <laughs> <laughs> no, some people really like it. Yeah, some people. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Okay, yes. go on. That's it. Uh -huh. Okay. Well, uh, we require it to be. Yeah. So it's like yeah. they have they have like good good and down. Yeah, that's true for me. I think yeah. that when the boss is the owner of the company, they have uh, like uh, better the uh, power. manner to, to treat their employees, right? What do you think it is? Yeah. It is? Or Celia? I can hear very well, yes. Sorry, I can hear very well. But I think that uh, everybody it, it, has the opportunity to be uh, a boss. I would like, uh, I know that I, first I have to be an employee. If I have a good employee, I can be a good boss. And if I am a good boss, I have the opportunity to change many things in the job, especially <laughs> if I have uh, had the bosses that I'll be bad with me that are be that have uh, been, have been <laughs> you with can me do the or difference. with my co-workers <laughs> yes i can make the difference in yeah. the job mm -hmm. yeah okay and, and celia yeah. um maybe that is a difficult question because i mean I think that everybody would like to be the boss. Uh, but as you said, as you discussed, depending on the, I mean, what kind of employees do you have? And I mean, what kind of attitude do you have to? Because not, not everyone can be a boss. You know, everyone has like the attitude to be a boss, or like the, the, soft the way to be a boss. So. So maybe for me to be a boss is a little bit difficult. It's not like easy. I mean, it's not uh, easy as you as I can think, because I think that is uh, it has. So I think that could be my my dream job and the task, and it could be watch the project, watch the resource, watch the cost, the the timeline. Um, it could be all the tasks. Okay. That's really nice. Are you an engineer? <laughs> no, I'm not an engineer, but I am studying a master of project management. Uh, yeah, okay. That's great. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. in my case, I would like to continue my my career in accountant. 
And I want to follow. In accounting. Uh, or my career, my career as an accountant. Account, I, I am an accountant, but I want to uh, learn more about master or to be an auditor. Mm -hmm. Yeah, nice. uh, for me, I'm finishing my career as a business administrator. Do uh, me too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm a business administrator. <laughs> so I have to to get my own business. That's my dream job to have my own business. And as I told you before, that's the opportunity to do what you really want to do, and you don't need to wait for others to tell you what to do. <laughs> so Marcela, I guess you think alike, right? You would like to have your own business as well? Yes, I think it's almost Marcel. Sorry, I can hear you. You want to have your own business as well? Yeah, in the future, like, um, I don't know, 20 years? Or Years, when I have the experience in project manager, I want to be, no, I want to have a um, little, I don't know how to say in English, but it's like, I don't know how to say it is. When you have the opportunity to teach other how to do it. But it's not a teacher, it's like you are, you, what? Trainer? No, oh. it's not trainer. A mentor? Oh, uh -huh. it, it may be a coach. A coach or a mentor? It's probably a mentor, no? A mentor, uh -huh. yeah, a mentor. Yeah, you have the opportunity to be a mentor. Okay, very good. And Glenda, what kind of uh, business would you like to have? What well, field? I would like, <laughs> yeah, I would like to, to have a, Bar restaurant. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I have a lot of friends and I can see how they feel about these kind of places and they are always able to go and eat and get some drinks and I think it's a really good business. Yeah. Nowadays. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. If you ever open one, let us know what the name of it is. So okay. <laughs> I can visit it. <laughs> I <hope so. laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, the best job for me maybe uh, like uh, a player like a football player I mean if I can if I can if I uh, I don't know what to say if I can play football maybe a football player I don't I, I can't but if ah. it, it will be fun because you you do what you love and and it's and it's like like easy. I mean you have to train and and everything, but you you practice, you play, and you earn a lot of money. You become famous too. <laughs> yes. And you become yeah. famous too. <laughs> Very rational, but yeah. What question are you discussing, guys? Uh, number what is two. The best? The Some second the one. Jokes. The second one. Ah, the really? Joke. Just a second question? <laughs> okay. Yep. I think we're going to go back for a while. Okay. Okay. All right, guys, welcome back. How many questions did you discuss? Almost all of them. Two, Two. all of them. <laughs> Layla's questions. group, they were really engaged. They only asked two questions. <laughs> they were a lot. How many, Misael? Sorry. Five questions. Five questions, okay, that's good. And some of you discussed almost all of them. All righty, well, the get some work done on the platform okay we're starting section three who wants to read the objective volunteer IBM 
by the end of this lesson, you will learn about different favors that people ask and express and express your opinion and favors that you dislike people asking for you. People asking you. Let's see. Hmm. All right, uh, uh, read the instructions, please. Let me see, Carla, Leon. Okay, let me just, instructions. Uh, watch the video below and take note of all the favors that are asked. Is that? Mm -hmm. Which are the favors uh, that would bother which you are the most? Favor which are the favors that will bother you the most, which will bother you the least. Write your comments on the discussion forum below the video. Okay, take notes guys, this is plural. Take notes on uh, the favors and then we'll discuss. But before we do that, I would like to give you some, some feedback on the conversations I heard. All right, for example, um, if, let me give you one example and you tell me what is wrong with it, okay? So if you are a manager, you don't have to be late or let's say arrive late at the office. Okay, what is incorrect in this sentence? Arrive at is not a mistake, by the way. That is right. At Help office. me find the mistake. Sorry? At office? No, that's not no. a mistake. Mm -mm. The? No. At the office? Mm -mm. The word arrive. Arrive? No, it's not, it's not wrong. Uh, late. You don't have you don't have to no, why is that yes that is wrong okay why yeah. Roberto is that you I don't see everyone at the same time I can only you see haven't to arrive you don't have to arrive okay yeah this is incorrect but can somebody tell me why this is a very common mistake so I would like you to take notice of it all right it's I will tell haven't. you Mm -mm. No, I will tell you why. Guys, don't, don't have to mean you are free of responsibility. Okay? You're translating this when you say it as responsibility. This is Spanish, okay? In English, it doesn't work like that. So, guys, do you have to study on Friday? Do you have to be in class on Friday? So no, we don't. Friday. Okay, so we're saying we don't have to be in class on Friday. Okay. Is it prohibited? No, right? It's simply that you are free of responsibility on Friday. And you can say, oh, I'm so happy because tomorrow I don't have to work. Is that clear? It's a good thing. This is a positive thing. Oh, I don't have to work. So in this context, it doesn't work what you should say instead. Instead, I'm going to cross it out so you can see it. Okay, what you should say instead is shouldn't or can't or must not, all right? Something to express prohibition, but not free of responsibility. But if you are a manager, you shouldn't arrive late at the office, okay? Or it depends. You must not, if you want to be very strict, right? Must not arrive, la, la, la. And you cannot arrive late at the office. Is that clear? I would like you to use all of these substitutes, but not don't have to in this context, because don't have to is a good thing. All right. It's clear. Clear. Awesome. It's Very good. Yes. It's happened because we are using like a, because it's a condition, right? Because we are using if. No, not necessarily. In this not context, necessary. what I'm saying is, yeah, the manager, it's not like he doesn't have to arrive late because this means free of responsibility. So the meaning of don't have to is not the same as it is in Spanish. Okay, that's why. 
So I will give you another example without the conditional so that you can get it mixed up. We would say, um, for example, Salvadorians shouldn't. No, I'm going to give another example. So uh, people under 18. Mm -hmm. This is incorrect, okay? People under 18 don't have to drink alcohol. This is incorrect. Why? Am I saying, look, look, guys. People under 18 are free of responsibility. No, right? Or is it a prohibition? It's a pro uh, prohibition. Aha, uh -huh, exactly. It's a restriction, a prohibition. It's not right. So we don't use don't have to. We're going to say shouldn't. Okay. Actually, must not, because it's the law. It's the law. So must not. Must not. Must not drink alcohol or shouldn't drink alcohol okay That's don't cool. have to is a good thing um, it's like to say in spanish no tienen que or no deberían uh -huh, shouldn't, like, no, no tienen no que it's not a prohibition in english uh -huh. we're only going to use it for positive things so i can say uh people i don't know hold on Tell me a good thing. Um, who has who has to wear a uniform? That's a good thing. I think that not having to wear a uniform is a good thing. So me personally, Doctors or nurse. I don't have to wear a uniform. This is right, guys. Okay, because of the pronunciation of this is a consonant. You say a uniform, not a uniform. Okay, so I don't have to wear a uniform, and I'm happy about it. Why? I don't have that responsibility. Okay. Who else? Do you have to wear a uniform, guys? At work? Just no. on Fridays. Fridays? Yeah, no, I, I, I do. don't have to. Uh -huh, yeah. You don't have I to. Know, no. Okay. Or some, I don't have to. some people say, for example, on Fridays, I, have to. I don't have to wear a tie. So you feel free, right? Oh, I don't have to wear this tie. It's finally Friday. So you feel free of that responsibility, okay? So I hope that's clear. And another thing, let me see. Okay, is this mistake? Please be conscious of it. So you're gonna say, depending on what kind of job you do, kind of job you do, depending on what kind of job you do, that's the way you're gonna feel. Well, you can use depending on or depend on or depends on, but always use on, not off, okay? So your salary will depend on your education, we can say, right? Your salary. Your experience. Will depend, oh, I already have it, depend on your experience, okay. And so this one depends on. If I tell you, Guys, can you can you join me for an additional class on Saturday? And you're gonna say, mm, I don't know, teacher. It depends on on the time of the class, right? It depends on if you're going to give us extra points. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need any extra points. <laughs> so it depends on. Oh yeah, well, if you want to say that, it depends on the reward. Okay, but always mm -hmm. use on, not off. So those are common mistakes I noticed. And mm -mm, yep, that's it, I guess. All right, now let's continue. Any questions about that? No. no. <laughs> Not. <laughs> All right, let's watch. Take notes, please. Be ready. Here we go. Rachel, I am so glad you're home. I was wondering if you could help me out? Yeah. What's up, Anne? I need a big favor. My boss just called and he wants me to go out of town this afternoon to meet. Can you hear well? Mm, yes, I, I can. Well. Oh. Yes, teacher. Yes. No, teacher. Oh, yeah. It's well, like slow. It's kind of low. Uh, it, yep. Yeah. But, um, all right. Everyone mute your microphones, please. And let's listen again.
Rachel, I am so glad you're home. I was wondering if you could help me out. Yeah. What's up, Anne? I need a big favor. My boss just called, and he wants me to go out of town this afternoon to meet with a client. That's great. Yeah, but my parents are out of town, too, and my little sister Megan is staying with me. Would you mind if she stayed with you tonight? I could pick her up tomorrow by 10. Uh, no, I don't mind at all. Uh, what time did you want to bring her over? How about now? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Megan. Did you want to spend the night here? OK. Great, uh, but I have a report to work on tonight. Don't worry, we planned ahead. She brought her homework. She'll keep herself busy. Fantastic. I, I have to run. Thanks a million. Oh, you're welcome. Bye, Meg. Have fun, but do your homework, OK? Don't worry, Ann. I will. Bye. What grade are you in, Megan? Eighth. Hey! You've got the Twilight movies. Can we watch them? Uh, sure, but I think you should do your homework first. OK. Good. Uh, you can work in here. I have some work to do, too, so I'm going to go to my office. OK. the homework coming? Good. I did half of my math problems. That's good, but you still have some more work to do. You can watch the movie when you're done, OK? Rachel! Yes? I'm done. Is it OK if I watch the movie now? Yes! <laughs> I'm starving. Can I have something to eat? Uh, it's only four in the afternoon. So? Um, okay, how about some carrot sticks and an apple? What else have you got? I have some strawberries and whipped cream. Anything else? Okay, how about a pizza? I have one in the freezer. Plain? I think it's a veggie pizza? That sounds good. I love this part. I know. It's so romantic when Edward tells her he loves her. Does he stay with her? You mean you've never read any of the books or seen the movies? No, I was too little. But I'm old enough to understand them now. Can we watch the second movie after this one's over? I have a better idea. <laughs> Anybody home? Oh, good morning. Good morning. What's going on here? We stayed up late reading Twilight. I loved it when Bella first dreamed about Edward. Oh, me too. The part where Jacob appears? Wow. We must have lost track of time. We ought to get going, Megan. All right, I'll grab my stuff. These books are the best. Would you mind if I borrowed this one? Oh, no, go ahead. Thanks. You two really seem to hit it off. How'd you do it? <laughs> I guess a good book can still bring people together. The drama and the music is funny. <laughs> All right, let's see if we have some of the uh, answers here. OK. No, we're not discussing any of these. We're going to do something different, OK? as uh, the last practice. So. 
Did you see the image I sent you? I'm gonna show it to you, but, but check what's up, please. Open the image, I'm gonna open it as well. And that's the activity we're going to do about favors, okay? And what does the first one say, guys? It says, could you do me a favor? And it says, favors people dislike being asked. First one says, could you? Let me use your card. Let me use, Let me use your card. Let me use your car. Okay, second one. Could you could drive you me to the airport? the airport? Okay, next. Could you could lend you me some, some money? money? All right, I have it here. Could you lend me your toothbrush? Your hairbrush. <laughs> hairbrush. So here's the image. Uh -huh. um, I would like you to discuss which is the the most, well, the one that annoys you the most, okay, or the one that you hate being asked the most, then the one that bothers you the least, all right, and then discuss if you have ever asked for this favor and if Mira, you have ever done something like this. Excuse me. <laughs> I know it's you. All right, so let's see. Us, okay, what's the worst favor to be asked? The least annoying one, uh, what favors you've done, why they are uncomfortable. All right, let's talk about all of them. Ready? Okay, we're gonna work in groups okay. of three so you can get more participation. And there it is. Let me see one, six, two to three. All right, accept the invitation, please. And let's talk about this. I could be no, no, no. I don't have a problem. Yeah, and um, um, let me some money. Yeah, and which one do you dislike the least? It is. Uh, dislike the least, maybe. Let me see. Uh, when people um, ask me for your car or could. Could I use your car, for example? If, if someone asks for a favor like this? I sent a second image and there are some questions at the bottom. Could you discuss those? Uh, oh, let really? me see. I see one. Oh, the one that says, imagine that a, that a class... Because you know how they drive. Oh, yeah. uh, Yes, or maybe they they drive not so well, but you don't 
you you but it's your family <laughs> yes it's your family yeah you don't have an option <laughs> Yeah, the yeah. next one is, uh, could you drive me to the airport? I think uh, for, that is not so annoying. For me, for me it's okay. It's okay, mm -hmm. yeah. I don't have any problem about that. If I can, I, I, I do. It's just no a trip. Yeah. Mm -hmm. In my case, and... But I I offered my my own car, but I I I didn't I didn't I didn't I didn't want. You didn't learn. You didn't learn that uh, your no. car to, to your friend. No. Because of the uh, seguro. No. Uh, insurance. Insurance. Uh, I insurance. I don't have insurance. Insurance. But and I think that. Insurance. The Lena, Lena car is very, I, uh, definitely I, I won't, I won't do, I won't do. It's definitely something I wouldn't do. Yeah. So it's a, it's a big responsibility, but sometimes in a while uh, there is uh, a friend asked me uh, to lend my car and I couldn't say no. <laughs> I couldn't say no. Uh -huh. Teacher, uh, we were discussing about fiador. Uh, uh, but in English, how do you say fiador in ah, English? You're a... um, okay, I, I can't remember. Let me see. Yeah, I know the word, but I will not remember quickly. So I will look it up and see if I can find something. Misael found yes. Mis, Misael found a word, but it's a little bit strange. No, that is the one. Listen, it's a guarantor. I'm gonna take Guar guarantor. guarantor. Yes, like you need a guarantor. guarantee, and the person is a guarantor. Guarantor. Ah, like it comes from guarantor. guarantee and can, guarantor. Can you can you write it? I, yes, guarantor. You got it. It's the same word that I that I found. Yes, yes, but this is the one who's a guarantor. Guarantor. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. I never been to 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 be a, a guarantor. That is the anyone. worst favor on earth being a guarantor. Uh -huh. I always say no, I can't do this. You're right, guys. That is the worst one. I'm so ever. sorry. <laughs> I love you so much, but I cannot be your guarantor. I know, yeah. You got it. That's the one. Let's go back. Okay, here we are. Sorry, I think I didn't see everyone, right? I didn't go to every group, but this was a short conversation. Maybe tomorrow we can extend it a little, okay? Um, but I listened to something. You're totally right, Karen and, and, oh, and Misael. They're saying that the worst favor that you can be asked is to be a guarantor. You know what that is? Oh, uh, fiador. Oh my fiador. gosh, that is the worst uh, thing. A guarantor. A what? What is the word? I'm sorry. Guarantor. It comes from like guarantee, and the person is a guarantor. You know oh that? yes. That, I think that is number one mm. in my rank. <laughs> I don't know if it's for you. <laughs> Can you write to teacher? Yeah, I just sent it. Hold on, I'm gonna show it to you. Sure. What do you think? What are the worst ones, guys? Besides the ones I sent, can you think of another one? Lend them people money. Ah, uh, lend money yes. probably ranks number two in the list. You're right. Lend money. Like for me, I I don't mind. I don't mind like lending money to someone that if they told me in two weeks I pay you and they pay they me pay at the same time. I don't, yeah, and I don't have, I don't mind lending to them again. But if someone but told me, pay. we are going to pay you and they don't pay, they, they lost point in there. <laughs> you take yes, that risk. Shouldn't, obviously and sometimes shouldn't. There, are, there are people who's asking for money the first time and then don't pay back. Uh -huh, they don't and pay back. they ask 
again for more money. So in that the case, first time they pay, pay, but next. No, but you know that when I worked, yeah. when I worked in call centers, people would ask you for money, but they would ask everyone until they collected a big amount and then they quit. Oh my gosh, <laughs> those people, right? They're they're not people. I don't know how to call them. <laughs> Animals. <laughs> Okay, number three. We need to find number three. Come on. What's the worst? Um, One of the worst. Top three. Let Baby. me. Babysitting. Baby my, my car. Babysitting. Lending the car or babysitting? Those are big. I don't know. Let's decide, guys. Come on. <laughs> but, babysitting. But. A difficult question. All right, so if we vote, maybe babysitting, right? If I have to choose, yeah. I choose maybe borrow my car. Yeah, right. Okay, so babysitting is <laughs> probably ranking number three here. Okay, that was funny. Thank you very much, guys. Do you have any questions? No. No, I don't. No. Teacher. no. Okay, well, despite okay. the rain, the thunders, and, you know, the world ending, Thank you for being with us. <laughs> okay. Yes. Okay. The apocalypse is zombie. Okay. By the Thank apocalypse you. during class, that's good. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay. Bye-bye. Good night, everyone. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. Thank you.